Today and I was talking about the importance of information, obviously, in linking governments and citizens, and the possibility of using citizen observatories to do so. Um, but also the fact that um, information alone is not enough. So even if people have information, unless they are able to be sort of mobilized, if governments are able to understand and and have access to the same information, and engage with citizens and citizens to do the same, um, then a lot of times the information by itself doesn't make change. Essentially, it's important for, again, for information to be about what people's needs are and, and their priorities, but also in information about um, how people see or in, engage with the government officials um, to be understood by the government. And similarly, it's important for uh, individuals to understand the decisions that are being made, the actions that government is, is taking, um, as well as the processes by which they to make these decisions, right? In order for there to be better trust between citizens and governments, in order for there to also be better understanding of the needs and to, to see real change. Um, the Jasmine Foundation, I think, is doing a great job in terms of both collecting and gathering the types of information that, that people need. In fact, I was extremely impressed by the, um, the depth and the detail and the many different ways in which that information was gathered, right? For focus groups, citizen scorecards, um, you know, sort of a, a wide range of ways in which there was an understanding of the needs, of the attitudes towards the relationships between the municipality and the citizens, um, particularly with regards to, to youth and how they saw and, and viewed the situation. Um, it's also really, frankly, Frankly, exciting to see the the level of activity and action and the engagement of youth, which I think is a critical point to um, how this kinds of uh, this mobilization or this this level of interaction and information sharing can take place. So, um, kudos to them. Actually, no, it's really it's really really great work. And it was exciting and inspiring today to see, especially in the video, the kind of, um, yeah, the energy and the coming together. Um, obviously, there was also voice disappointments and frustrations. And um, my only hope is that with the continued efforts that a lot of those problems can be taken care of, essentially.